Good afternoon, everybody. I want to go ahead and recap how successful that we were on February 2nd of 2017. We're at the highs up here on Amazon quarterly earnings release. The high was 842. We had call options, as I recall, and we did. So the report comes out, Amazon beats by 12 cents, and they didn't like the guidance. So Amazon tanked right back here at this major support level, and that this low right here was 801. And we took advantage of it, and we went from 801 all the way up here to 860. They took the bad news on Amazon as far as future guidance far as the future guidance and on this particular trade it was a monthly contract that we had and that we had plenty of time and that volatility came in and we got net long we had open positions don't get me wrong we were down 13 grand in one account on our managed account program and then some of the other accounts were even down actually more but what we did was we tripled up we bought a whole bunch of call contracts off of the bottom and added to the position. Then some of the uh, managed account program people, well, they we didn't add any for them. We just stayed the course. And so from a negative deficit in a loss, we came roaring back like New York champions. And the trade dates, the proof, the call contracts, everything is here and we got paid and we did get paid and we did buy it why others who can't handle themselves actually you know freaked out because of the drop uh amateurs and so some of those people didn't get the big gains that we got they didn't want to hold the course Amazon is one of the best publicly traded companies out here in the retail space. They're in the hardware space. They're in the cloud business. They're in everything. So in October of 2016, Amazon missed the quarter and did the same thing. And so, yes, there's a lot of volatility, but it created a great buying opportunity and the buying opportunity was so well this is what it looks like also had the 860 put that hit a high at nineteen dollars and fifty cents where we were selling out and we made a great profit we bought those on february 15th and then we sold out on this friday expiration and what a great trade it was one of the greatest things that ever happened was that always buying the dip and creating the volatility in the call contracts. And we went from $801 up to 860 And we kept going day after day after day up. And we made a tremendous amount of money. And we bought the other side of everybody's fear. As everyone was fearful and getting out of the trade, what were we doing? We were buying. And this is a daily chart. And we had the call contracts. We added to the position. We took it up higher. We took a negative loss to a super big gain.